Hey guys, okay, we're back here with the Benjamin Moore Notable dry erase coating. It's been a few weeks. Um, actually, I wanted to wait even longer than I told you I was going to. So it's been about three weeks now since we put it on. Typically, you're supposed to wait seven days for a full, full cure. I waited three weeks, and the reason I waited three weeks is even though the other company's products erased in the beginning, I'm talking the first week or two, after that, it was a very heavily, a very heavy drop. Uh, in erasability, um, and really the last one I used, I had to use a solvent, xylene, to get off the, the writing, and I'm sure that's not what the manufacturer intended. So here we are, dry erase coating. What do I like about this? It's very shiny, as you can probably see. Um, I like that. It shows me that's probably going to erase very well. Um, it's, a, it's a hard coating, and by hard, I can you can feel it's harder. Um, it was easy to put on. That was the best thing for me. We could, we could mix it easily. Uh, it takes two coats and it's a wet on wet coating, which I loved. I didn't have to put a coat on and wait three, four hours to put another coat on or a whole nother day. Put one coat on, I think I waited a minute or two, whatever the specifications were, and I rolled it right again. It was great. I had no sags on this board like I would have with other coatings. And sags, I mean, the coating's a little heavier, so you'll start to see little runs go down your board. I've gotten that with every other coating. Um, it could be the coating, could have been me, I applied them all. But I didn't get it with this one. I did get it on another board in another room where I tried to put the coating on heavier than probably I should have. So I chalked that up to me. So erasability is awesome. Look guys, it's with my finger, it comes right off. I can't do that with anything else. I have a dry erase board right next to me. I can't wipe that off with, um, with my hand, with a rag, with anything. I have to use xylene to take it off. So, love it. You can see right here, no, no trick. Price range, I mean, it's not cheap. It's not an inexpensive product, but neither or are the other ones from you know, Rust-Oleum or Sherwin-Williams or um, the companies who just sell dry erase coatings. They're all pricey. Um, and you get what you pay for. The only thing is the other coatings cost the same and don't perform. So I highly recommend this one. This is the one we're gonna be using from now on. Um, again, we use it for everything in the, in the room. We have dry erase walls everywhere and we'll be adding this everywhere else. Um, I mean, the benefits of it actually erasing are huge. And it sounds crazy because they all should erase, but they don't. And try to get your money back from the other companies when you tell them that their stuff doesn't erase. They're gonna tell you you didn't apply it right or you didn't wait long enough in between coats. It's never gonna be their fault. It's gonna be your fault. Try that with any paint issue. So, again, Benjamin Moore Notable. It's awesome, I recommend it to everybody. Easy to apply. Uh, no issues, it didn't smell bad at all. Um, here we are, three weeks later, looking great. So I'll talk to you guys soon on our next product review.